Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Today we want to talk about the notification system in Microsoft Outlook and Windows 10 and how they work together. So you can see here right now I'm in Microsoft Outlook and I'm just going to quickly create an event and see what happens. So right now we are the 3rd of May. So 3rd of May is right here. And I'm going to create an event. Um, so I'm going to right click new appointment. Okay, and I'm going to make the event or the appointment at 9 p.m., which is 20 minutes from now. And I'm just going to say dinner. So I have a very late dinner today. And I'm going to set the reminder time as 30 minutes. So I'm going to save that. And you should see that I get this reminder. Okay, now this reminder is within Microsoft Outlook. But... The Windows notification system, which is on the bottom right hand corner, has an action uh, center and the reminder could potentially come up here instead of here. Okay, so what I want to talk about today is how to make a reminder come up in Windows 10 as well in the Windows 10 notification system. Uh, in which case you're going to have duplicate reminders and then in the next video I'm going to talk about how to remove uh, one of them. Okay, which is the Outlook one obviously because you want this one enabled or vice versa. Maybe you want to uh, just have the Outlook one and get rid of the Windows one. Uh, so how do you make this notification occur in the Action Center as well in the Windows notification system? Well, there is no direct setting in the Outlook app. Okay, what you need to do is if you want calendar events to occur in the Action Center, then in Windows 10, you need to open the calendar app. If you want the mail uh, notification, so when you get a new mail or a new email, you want a notifica notification to occur in Windows 10, then you need the Mail app. Okay, so uh, which one do we want? Well, we want a calendar notification, so let's get the calendar app. Now, you will see, initially, when you open this up, you will have uh, a blank calendar. So that's not going to work. You need to have the same calendar open in both Microsoft Outlook and the calendar app. So to open up a new calendar, you just click on um, settings, manage accounts, and make sure that you have the same email account open. So let's click add account. And if you have a, uh, let's say for your job, you probably have a Microsoft uh, Outlook Office 365 email or whatever. So just go to Outlook.com and type in your Outlook email. In my case, this is a personal email, but you guys probably have just whatever your work email is. And you probably have to type in a password or something like that. So it's imported my calendars. So um, I'm just going to focus on this calendar right here. And you can see that it's got my 9 p.m. dinner and there is your Windows 10 notification. And you can see in here, it's also got it in the Action Center. Okay, so let's say that you have opened up the calendar um, app and you've got the, you've got the calendar event, but um, it's not showing up here. Then what you need to do is you're going to go into notification settings, go into notification settings, and you're going to uh, go down to calendar, make sure it's on. If you are uh, trying to get email notifications, make sure the mail uh, notification is on and you can even go into it and make sure that you tick all of these boxes, show notification banner, show notification action center, 
just tick all of that and it should show up okay so that's how you get the outlook uh, notifications occurring in both outlook and the windows 10 notification center all right thanks for watching guys see you next time thanks for watching guys see you next time